Hello, my darling loves. Welcome to your monthly love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. I hope everybody is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits, and Guides, what clarity, guidance, love messages do we have here today for my Leos, please? Clarity, guidance, love messages for my Leos, please. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits, and Guides, clarity, guidance, love messages for my Leos, please. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits, and Guides, Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. All right, so let's see here. So we've got the Ace of Wands and the King of Wands. There you are, Leo. Hot stuff. We've got the Nine of Pentacles, Virgo energy, pre-Empress energy, the High Priestess, Cancer Piscean energy, the Wheel of Fortune, and the tower aries scorpionic energy um leo i feel like either you're going to be blown away by somebody or someone's going to be blown away by you okay i feel like someone is insanely attracted to you um someone sees you as spiritual independent beautiful someone here is just like how did i get so lucky how did I get so lucky? Someone here I think is just mesmerized by you. Or it could be vice versa. We've got the Empress, Aries, Taurus, Libra, Cancerian energy, and the Six of Wands. We've got the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy, and the Ten of Cups. I feel like someone's saying here, I think I just found my wife. I think I just found my husband. I think I just, I think I just found it. Two of Wands. And the Seven of Swords. So, again, I feel like someone feels that they've met the one. I feel like someone knows that they are going to marry you. I feel like someone knows that you're the one that they want to have a family with. But I feel like what's happening here is somebody... I feel like somebody is about to get the opportunity to cheat. Someone has a choice between two people. Like someone is coming in, like someone's coming into this picture and this person now has a choice to take this blessing or do something stupid. We've got the magician, Virgo, Gemini energy. Oh my gosh. Guys, hold on one sec. This person's calling me back to back. Okay. We've got the lover's card. Yes, yeah, see, the magician and the lover's card. I feel like this person's being tested, Leo. I feel like this person's being tested. I feel like, um, you know, they have a choice. Temptation is coming in. And I feel like someone manifested this love. And now they're being tested to see. Oh, for crying out freaking loud. Give me one moment, please. Okay, I'm sorry, I shut it off. Okay, so... Yeah, someone's being tested. Someone here has to make a choice if they want to give in to temptation or not. Oh, we got the Emperor to the Empress here. The Ace of Swords. The Seven of Cups. And the Eight of Cups. Yeah, no, I feel like this emperor is going to make the right decision, Leo. I feel like this emperor is going to make the right decision. Yeah, see, someone here has the option to cheat. Someone's going to be given the option. I feel like this emperor sees what they have in front of them. This emperor sees that they have an emperor, uh, empress and they know that this is a victory for them. Someone here sees clearly that they have met the one. And with the seven of cups to the eight of cups, someone here is disconnecting or walking away from all other options. And I see that with the three of wands and the chariot, someone has to make a decision about what they want here because we've got the three of cups and the fool. Someone is giving them the opportunity to mess around. 
okay someone is giving them the opportunity to mess around but this person i do feel is going to make the right decision spirit what messages do we have here for my leos please clarity guidance and love messages for my leos tell me about this ace of wands the five of cups oh wow so okay so leo this may be someone from your past that you have reconciled with and this person feels beyond blessed to have another chance by you and they're being given the opportunity to mess it up and i feel like the divine is seeing if they're worthy of your your second chance king of wands and the high priestess cancer piscean energy the nine of pentacles and the four of cups the high priestess and the king of swords aquarius gemini libra energy so you see Leo, someone is coming and telling you that they feel bad, but with the but you're over here, you're operating from your higher self, okay? And I feel like you may not want to take this off for you may want to stay single. I feel like your intuition is telling you to protect yourself. The wheel of fortune and the seven of swords, the tower, and the ace of pentacles. Someone here, you know, deserves to not be given a second chance, okay? But I feel that with the Tower and the Ace of Pentacles, you may make this off-the-wall decision to actually give this person a second chance, okay? This person does not deserve to be forgiven. They don't, okay? But divine timing, it's a thing, okay? You know what I'm saying? It's a thing. Um, I feel like this, this person is going to be tested. The divine is going to test this person for you. And I feel like there's a part of you, Leo, that kind of knows this. You're going to go ahead and tell this person, okay, let's do this, because you're trusting in the fact that if they screw you over again, the divine has your back. Like, I don't know why. Like, you just know this, okay? And, and it's true. It's true. I feel like you're coming into this connection very, you're, you're coming into this reconciliation very peace, peacefully. Sorry, I just like choked on my own words. Very peacefully. Because you know the divine has your back. Empress and the five of wands, the six of wands, and the ace of wands. So this person is feeling really good because they fought for you and they won. They won their pre-empress, okay? Knight of Pentacles, on top of the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Ten of Cups, and the Sun, Leo Energy. So now this person is slowly but surely starting their pursuit in having forever with you. And boom, here comes the Divine giving that temptation. Page of Wands, they get a message. Seven of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. What you gonna do? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What are you gonna do? Are you going to answer this person? Not are you gonna give in to temptation or not? Um, the magician and the judgment card, Sagittarian energy, the lovers and the emperor. So I feel like the divine. The divine wants to know where this person's head is at. What kind of decisions is this person made, is going to make? Because the divine has given this emperor an empress. And they want to know, are you deserving of an empress? Okay? And I feel like this emperor with the lover's card is going to choose to step into their, to their divine masculine and, and gain their victory and take their prize, take the blessing that's given. The Emperor and the Four of Swords, the Ace of Swords, and the Two of Swords. Yeah, this Emperor realizes the truth. I'm not going to do this because I ha Leo has already taken me back. We're in the process of recovering right now. And I am not going to do anything to mess that up. Seven of Cups and the Page of Pentacles. Eight of Cups and the world. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> the divine is going to test this person so much that it's not going to be just one person coming towards them. This person is going to get a bunch of messages from different females, different males, whatever. It's like out of nowhere, everyone's going to come out of the woodwork. But guess what, Leo? This person's walking away and with the world card shutting the door on all of these people because guess what? I have met my empress. I have my empress. That's all I need. Leave me alone. Don't talk to me because my girl knows how to fight. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't talk to me. Leave me alone. You know, so it, it's just this energy of, you know, someone here has gotten a second chance. And Leo, they are, um, 
they're realizing that they don't want to do anything to mess it up. They, it's a victory for them that they have gotten you back. They want forever with you and they're not going to do anything to, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Jeopardize this connection. They are not going to do anything to jeopardize that connection. Great gratitude and joy is fun. This person is so happy and so appreciative that they got a second chance with you, Leo. Um, the loving man and teacher. This person is in the process of learning your love language. They're learning how to be in a relationship. They're learning what's right, what's wrong. Fourth chakra journey and a uh, woman holding a heart. Yeah, I feel like this person is um, trying to find their way back to your heart again. I feel like this person is in the process of trying to heal your heart here, Leo. Um, this person wants forward movement with you. They, they want to win your heart back. Getting to know each other. Um, as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Unrequited love. There's not enough... Um, attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going and express your love go ahead and make the romantic gesture so this person went out and met a bunch of options has a bunch of options people that want to talk to your person you know build a stronger bond but your person doesn't love these people there's no love there okay your person knows where the love is and they're coming in to express it to you leo that's just the bottom line yeah this person is not going to do anything to jeopardize um what they have this time around. Okay. All right, guys, I love you and take care. Bye.